too many game strides? I know, I know. There's there's way too many. I don't know how you fit it all. I'm still going through Mystery Dungeon. I've been playing Digimon Cyber Sleuth for the longest time now, but that's also a JRPG, so you're waiting forever to make it happen. Yep. I, I remember I started playing Mystery Dungeon, and I was like, wait. And then Animal Crossing came out, and I was like, no, it's over. <laughs> Why'd I get this game? <laughs> Damn it. Animal Crossing is pretty fun, though. Yeah. Isn't not my cup of tea, but I see a lot of people have a good amount of fun with it. Yeah. yeah. See, I'd be a filthy time skipper, and I don't want to do with that. <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with time skipping. Th there I, isn't, I but for, it, but for but me, it's because of uh, what's it called? Because of Pokemon. So with Dens, I've been I've I've done frame skips and manipulate. So my Switch is already on like 2023, and right. so with Animal Crossing and Pokemon, it would just get too hard to keep track of it. Oh, oh yeah. and Circa, you know, not trying to play the game right now, or... Hmm. Are you, you trying to tough it out? What's good? <laughs> Wait, no way. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Is he just like, yo, I'm gonna throw this stock away and I'm still gonna body? <laughs> yo, I don't need it, dog. <laughs> huh. huh. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if that was because of the, uh... The, the adapter and he just didn't reset his controller for a second or was he just holding right yelling at his mom so who knows turn the wi-fi off please <laughs> uh, not too sure what's going on here but can we get a time uh, at least. like damn shout, shout out to amber reaper for the for the raid thank you Ooh. good looks good looks they picked the wrong stage all right, well, if you guys picked the wrong stage, you guys can go ahead and get the next one going, you know? Yeah, can you can you go as D real quick? Like... <laughs> <laughs> Start to wish about it. <laughs> it's not that hard. Right, so you just SD and then start another yeah. match on special, right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. I was like, I think it's like <laughs> pretty, pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> hey man, it's, it's not everyone's first rodeo. Should be. All right. Thank you, voice of God. <laughs> Let's go, James. All right, so I'm assuming it's probably gonna be the same matchup. So we're gonna have Inkling. Yeah, versus we're, Boy. we're just going over to Smashville now. They just picked the wrong village. Hmm. I, I feel like Inkling should win this matchup, but Roy, I, like down tilt's very very solid. I I don't know if you can like how hard it is to get the up close jab when Inkling's like dashing around. I think if anything, Inkling slightly wins and i feel like it's maybe like a 52 53 at that too i wouldn't say the full 55 just because it's like yeah inkling can rack up a lot of damage edge guard fairly well you have the confirms off of the up throw uh, especially a couple percents for the booyah but right dude, roy just has that sword and it hits so goddamn hard <laughs> right if you're not sealing off the stocks and you have roy with rage like you're gonna die if you decide to yeah, I mean, at that too, like, even though Roy's sword is only most effective on the tilt, it is still a disjoint. And when you look at Inkling, Inkling just has, you know, that bastard, the splatter gun. And even that back air is your most, you know, furthest reaching move at that anyway. Right. Okay, the spot dodge into the down tilt. We're gonna set up. No, just gonna go for the back airs here. No splat bomb on the ledge trap. No, not getting the good hit on that up air uh, from Ultra. So he's just going to show here at the ledge. Ooh, no, dashing back and Circa, you know, pretty brave to just go ahead and just run up on there. Oh, does it catch the roll though? And right now, Circa with the lead. Oh, ooh, I you don't, yeah, you don't get those in Wi-Fi. Yeah, maybe back there wouldn't have killed there. I'm pretty sure he didn't want to jab there. I'm pretty sure he wanted like jab back there. But there it is. Up throw up air, going to take it. And uh, Circo with, you know, he had a little bit of rage, but not too much. Oh, man, Splatter Shot. That move is so good. It is the most unpunishable move ever. In it's Ultimate. crazy how good that move is. <laughs> I played with Hope one time, and I was like, bro, what do I do? He's like, you just don't do anything. Accept it. 
Yeah, that move is very, very good. Alright, no, Sarka doing a really good job of just making himself scarce. Uh, Ultra really just struggling to land some type of hit. And when he does, he's not getting the correct hitbox that Roy needs to really put on a lot of that pressure. Oh yeah, for sure. There's the up air and... I mean, Sir Sarka doing a really good job of surviving. Oh, this back row could be the stock here. Sets up the... Tries to get... Oh! Oh! The splatter shot hit him <laughs> on the way up with Uppy? That is wild. I thought he had the tech because he got hit, and that uh, unfortunate, like, I, I like to call those, like, kind of half-and-half SDs. You know? mm -hmm. I they mean, it's just something. the fear, and, and it's the muscle memory. It's like, you get hit off stage, you're expecting you have to tech. Right. Okay, there is the up air to close it out, but Circa is the one with the entire stock lead here. Oh, yeah. At 0%, you can't. You can't. There's no guarantee for confirms off of the uh, landing back here. Yeah, you we, just, to, we like, just saw the jab immediately coming off from Altro. And getting them off Ooh, of them. Big damage with a lot of ink. Man, my man Roy is pure orange out here. Look at all this damage he's taking. He's pretty much fully inked. And, oh man, Circa, Circa's moves are going to start hitting for a lot of damage. Oh, Ooh, that and that's going to be it. You're not mashing out on Wi Fi. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> and like, he was at such a high percent anyway. Like, even with a perfect mash, you probably wouldn't be able to get out. Like, yeah. And that was unfortunate, man. Um, I feel like uh, Circa just had so much momentum off of that uh like directional air dodge sd and ultra really like he was forced to approach inkling and when you are forced into that particular situation it can be really hard yes sir but there we go circa gets that first game will we see a possible counter pick coming up from ultra it was looking pretty rough so i, I think if anything possible character switch but I don't know. I think Circa was just on a completely other level in that last game. Yeah, especially that last stock. He kind of like. He definitely slapped him to the point where it's like, yeah, I could definitely see a character switch here. Mm -hmm. So, Circa Prime was actually the person that uh, is 1 0. Outro did not win that last game. But we'll see what character we go with here. Of course, the stage pick could be different as well. Oh, wait a minute. Circa's oh. like, yo, wait. I'm trying to have some fun too. Maybe he's just switching the color. Who knows? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Probably a possibility. I mean, it's a thing that a lot of Inklings do, especially with how many costumes they have. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Inkling is very privileged. <laughs> Back here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, dude, we've been seeing a lot of trainers, man. The character's not good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, contrary to Pauper, really, really very good. Mm -hmm. go. Alright, so, looks like the trainer pick coming out. And I feel like everyone's, like, yo, everyone be out here with pocket trainers. To me, that's weird. Like, I think trainer is a very difficult character to play. Um, I, I think it's a very hard character to pocket, but... And everyone be out here with on, on maybe that's the Wi-Fi meta dude pocket trainer <laughs> Pocket trainer. I mean it stays true to the game honestly to the series But no, I, I definitely agree with you uh, Kareem because when you when you look at Pokemon trainers It's like okay, you have three characters that you're gonna have to go and try to manage and learn But for this to go ahead and be your pocket character I mean hey, maybe it's just a testament to, to the players nowadays where they've gotten so much better that they can Handle a character like this to go ahead and be in the back pocket for them when everyone's pocket trainer, like, their Squirtle doesn't have the sauce. Like, like, <laughs> like they, they, like, try to get something started, and they're like, eh, I'm just going to so Bro, like, that's that, why that's no one plays Pichu. <laughs> oh, true, true. That's why no one plays Pichu. It's like, yo, I'm going to die to a sneeze. I can't deal with this. I'm going Ivy and Charizard. Oh, wow. And he was just out of range on that grab there, and Alfred was able to punish with the up smash. Um, out of shield, like on reaction, so it really good stuff. But the roller, the forts, yeah, mm, he got that charge on it too. God damn. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, it's Wi Fi, so it's gonna be a little harder to mash out. And I believe um, the heavier characters you cannot up smash, or there, there's, I know there's like a chart out there, but essentially, mm. the more, the heavier the character, the harder it is to get the up smash. Like, it won't, 
con um, connect correctly out of the berry. So you'll see Inklings go for the forward smash instead. All right, but fairly even for sense right now. Uh, Ultra coming in with that neutral air out of shield, just catching Circa a little bit, but Circa evening up the percents and even taking the lead. With that slick conversion from the up throw. Yeah, so and time. I mean, people say Inklings not good. It's pretty crazy, man. Like I, I, I watch Inklings do like zero to fifty, zero to sixty combos. Like it's just like, damn, yeah, people actually wild to me. But right now, I mean, pretty even game considering it's Inkling. Yeah, yeah. Go Chasing him down at that too. That was three rollers just in a row immediately. <laughs> yeah, and I, I will say this: roller is a lot better on Wi-Fi than it is offline. So, like, you're, you're definitely gonna see rollers hit a decent amount more on Wi-Fi than you would offline. It's a, it's a little oh, harder easy. to react to. But I like that anti-air coming out from Circa with that up tilt. Oof. That's clipping him away. Back air, not going to connect, but it should be a punish. No, he ends up trying to come up with that up air. I think he was just trying to get that landing hitbox on it. Oh no. Back throw, yeah, just gonna get this damage here. Oh, directional air dodge, but He's I'm gone. inkling what it do. Four throw should kill here, yeah. It moves. yeah. The the buffs four throw is actually insane. And it's, it's crazy because not a lot of characters kill off of forward throw that early because when you're ledge trapping, um, like grabbing normal getup is such a common like, option that's like, I wouldn't say it's super easy to do, but you know, top players have gotten really, really good at it. So, oh, yeah, and, and, that, like, and it's the option that you see the most usually uh, when you do get a grab at that ledge. But there we have another roller into the forward smash. Circa getting the quick 2 0. Another pocket trainer has fallen. See if it was All pocket right. cloud, they'd be doing well. They don't have the power up. They, yeah, exactly. If you have the if you have the pocket cloud here at crisis core, you're ready to roll. Honestly, in our block, every cloud is one. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. So uh, you people at home that are still in bracket, bust out the cloud. Why not, dude? I mean, it it you know it's it's a like so what what is the pricing? So this is a this is a free online term. So. If you guys are watching and you didn't enter this tournament, it was free, so it sucks to be you. Mm -hmm. um, the Korean, we're fighting for pride, glory. Yeah, uh, I'm not too sure what the, like, the prize is the actual. Like, um, being able to clown people in the group chats or something. I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> Wi-Fi, supremacy. Like, damn. Bringing out the pocket trainers. Land of pocket trainers, dude. Oh, no. When I, when I think of Wi-Fi... I just think everyone turns the mid tier off the bat. <laughs> there, there's no low tier anymore. Wi-Fi wi right. just brings everyone up. Yeah. And Samus, Sonic, just instantly become top tier. Easy. Yep. <laughs> it's not fair.